Okay, so you got your massive G9 ultra wide monitor. And all you want to do is get those nice uh, RGB lights going on the back, as you can see from my mirror there. So let's go ahead. I, I actually have mine working already. I'm going to, as you can see, when the monitor wakes up, it should actually show them if I have it. Right, I may have turned it off, so let me turn it back on first. Sorry, guys. Okay, so you can see, so I'm just going to select the input. My laptop is hooked up to DisplayPort, and uh, I'm just going to get logged in or at least show you. Um, Oh, what that looks like probably got to wake it up but you can see you can see the uh, right there see the lights all right so I want to show I want to show my guy Philip what that actually looks like my docking station acting crazy on me trying to wake up my laptop but Anyway, I'm not going to worry about waking my laptop up right now, but really I need to get a new laptop. But anyway, I'm going to show Philip how you do this. So let's go here, hit the power button, right? Might have to turn it back on. All right, so you go into menu, and then it's actually not where you would think, at least it wasn't for me. Uh, oh, man, look at me. I went to a diagnostic. I really don't know what I'm doing. Okay, bear with me. Um, do you still need to see? No. Okay. All right. So here we go. We're going to find this real quick. And it's not, what I know is that it's not where you would think it would be infinity okay here we go so let's go back so it's under game as you can see here Philip you're gonna go to or anybody who's looking for you're gonna go to game and infinity core lighting and then you can go in here and make sure that's turned on and then toggle this you can actually change the effects I have mine on rainbow and once you have that set you're good to go come out of settings and I think I took and turned my laptop off but I'll put it in sleep mode but anyway when it comes back up you'll be able to see Type C is like pain in the butt too, but anyway, back up and as you can see, there's the lighting and there's the beast. Massive, massive guys. So I actually absolutely love this display. I want to make sure that I upload this so my guy Philip can uh, try to run it for himself. Not sure what I was looking at here, but anyway, I'm always looking at something. But anyway, that's it. There you have it, Philip. And anyone else who is looking for how to get your lighting effects working on the Odyssey G9. What up, what up, what up, fam? Peace, love, and blessings. Big homie coming back real quick. Um, this is going to be a quick video um, to anyone out there who is uh, who has the um, Samsung Ultra Wide Neo G9 uh, monitor, and you can't figure out where to get to the light settings. Now, 
specific special shout out to my guy Philip Brockman. Um, my bad on the time zone, Philip. I know you said. I think you said you were. Um, uh, I forget where you said you were, but I know you're overseas. But I hope that you will get the notification and see this tonight, brother. Um, so without further ado, let me go ahead and show you. Now keep in mind, I don't have this memorized, but we're going to walk right through it together. All right, so let's go.